Hey you guys, it's me Morgan and welcome to my channel. So today I have a hair review. I have not done a hair review in a while, but today I have a V part wig that I'm excited to show you. And the wig is from Ash Marie Hair. And y'all, ever since I've been pregnant also, I've been liking my V part wigs because they're easy, low maintenance, and just, you know good to go basically so today i have a deep wave v part so this is her let me show you so this is her um i did wash her yesterday so i washed her and let her air dry but to me the texture looks more like curly like a deep wave slash like curly but the curls are very very nice on here and like I said, this is 20 inches and this is 250%. Okay, so also in the wig, we have four combs in the front, two on each side. So there's one, two, three, four. And then there are combs on the side. And then we have an elastic band with an adjustable, I cannot talk, adjustable strap, okay? All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this bonnet off. Last night I washed my hair and put perm rods in it. And so I really don't know what's going on down here. Okay, we have this going on. Okay, so one of them fell out. I do know that. And this is it. These are the perm rods. I really like them uh, because they snap like that. They're really cool. Before I use, not perm rods, flexi rods. Um, before I use the ones that don't snap. I want to try those. So... I did like try to prep my hair because I washed it and I really didn't want to put any heat on my hair. So I just put these in and like wet set it and hopefully it comes out nice. I should have been, I should have used like a smaller um, flexi rod, but we're going to see how these go. Um, that one goes this way. I'm trying to look in the viewfinder because I don't really have like a, I have a mirror in front of me, but it's not like the biggest mirror where I can see. Okay, so <laughs> this is how I'm looking. So I'm just going to go ahead and take the wig and I'm going to open up these clips over here. Oh, there's actually an extra clip on the back. And I'm going to clip this in. And I really need a mirror, so I'll be right All right, so I have a mirror down here. So I'm going to be looking down while I put them on. But I have a part that is right here. And my hair did, these curls did come out pretty nice for them to be flex, um, flexi right? So I'm just going to go ahead and... Snap that one in. Snap this one in. Make sure the hair is not stuck, which it got stuck. Oh gosh. Pull it out. Okay. All right. And then the other side. Y'all, it's so hard. We don't have like a mirror, literally. Like right right in front of you and then this one okay and I, sh I really should have used smaller smaller ones but we're gonna make this work okay trust the process all right and then after that you just put these combs in on the side and in the back all right voila so this is what it looks like when I first put it on I haven't done anything to it these are clearly sticking out so what I'm going to do to get rid of these like random pieces sticking out like this is I'm going to take my leave out where is it I'm take my leave out 
and I'm gonna grab a piece of the hair and I'm just going to twist it intertwine it like that so it blends in so I'm gonna go ahead and do that to my whole head okay so this is the final look so like I said all I did I had to get really close to the mirror too as well so that's why I did it off camera but all I did was take like my leave out and then like a couple few strands of the wig and I just twisted it together in like a loose twist so it came out like this so like right here's a twist but you honestly cannot tell even up close you cannot tell so yes it went in perfectly next time I'll definitely use smaller perm rods because the one I the ones that I use were a little too big but if I use the smaller ones probably like not I keep saying perm rods flexi rods um if I use a smaller one it will turn out a lot better but you know this is a really cute um the hair is super super soft like it feels like I don't know like this is probably the softest hair I have touched in a while um like I said I did get 20 inches so curly it comes down to here and then when you pull it it's longer so curly hair is usually measured when it, you pull it and whatever that length is so yeah it's really soft um like I said this is a deep wave texture uh, but it's giving me more like curly vibes um deep wave is usually like a little bit looser so just you know FYI in case y'all wondering um so yeah so I'm going to show you the goodies they gave me as well they did give me a comb which I can always use a rat tail comb so I got a comb I got this elastic band I don't know if this one is yeah this is an elastic band to put inside the wig I believe um or if you tie it in the front I don't know I don't know but there's an elastic band in here <laughs> and then I also got a edge brush and this edge brush is kind of cool because I'm gonna open it Cause I've never seen one with the comb like this. Y'all see that? The comb is like feathered. So I got that. And then last but not least, I did get um, wig cap, which I never use wig caps anyway. I have so many wig caps. But yeah, this hair is very, very nice. It's very full. Like I said, it's 250% density. And it's super, super soft. So... I love it it's so cute easy to do easy to throw on and then also you guys don't have to leave that much hair out I left too much hair out and use too big of a flexi rod so yeah I think it looks okay cute let me turn around so y'all can see the back of it So yeah, I absolutely love it. So this is it. I'm going to leave all the info and details below. And thank you so much, Ash Marie Hair, for sending me this beautiful wig that I love, that I'll definitely be using, especially during these times, because it's an easy, like, throw on and go. I don't have to put heat on my hair and nothing like that. But yeah, you guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.